Okay, so now we're under the car. What I usually start by doing is just removing the exhaust clamp between the cat back and the downpipe or midpipe. Um, so my clamp is a little bit different because this is aftermarket. So usually it's a 13 millimeter. And then you're also going to start taking off these hangers. I like to uh, spray them with WD-40 before I try to take them off just so it makes it a little bit easier. So there's two right here. There's one right there. Go down And then you go down right near the end. Another hanger over here. Another hanger. You can actually take these off instead of this if you want, but yeah, I'm probably gonna just take this off and hope for the best. And then the entire cat back is just gonna slide out. Well, not slide out, it's gonna fall off. <laughs> so you kinda gotta catch it. But uh, I'm gonna do that real quick. And uh, yeah, shouldn't take too long. Most of the cat bag is off. Um, I'm just gonna let this fall and try to <laughs> disconnect it from the top. Also, I got something in my eye. So I decided that I'm going to actually take this hanger off and to do that you're just going to need a 13 millimeter again. Uh, get an extension, just makes things easier. So I'm just going to be taking this hanger off. And you can see that there's just two bolts, one right there and another right there. So yeah, you can just take that off and then it just, it just makes it easier to put onto the cat back. So, yeah. So just finished up the uh, exhaust, uh, I'm going to start it up and basically check if there's any leaks. Um, what you should do is generally take it for a drive, let it cool off and then retighten all the uh, clamps and whatnot. Um, I don't know if I'm going to do that, I'm kind of tired so uh, I may just take a, take a risk. But um, yeah, let's uh, start it up see how it sounds. <laughs> 